I'm Ethan Moy, and I'm here with Janelle Sergey, assistant women's hockey coach. You guys split again this weekend against CHA rival Mercy Hurst, winning 3 1 on Friday and 5 3, losing 5 3 on Saturday. What were your overall thoughts on the weekend? Um, I was quite disappointed on the first period against Mercy Hurst. Uh, I thought the girls came out very relaxed um, and took it all for granted. And I know the coaching staff in general was disappointed just because of how hard we worked on Friday to get that win and then to come back and basically let up on Saturday. But we really wanted to take it to them. So that was frustrating, but the girls came back good the second two periods and battled hard. It was just too far, too far gone. Yeah. Uh, and in the first game, uh, Mackenzie Johnson, freshman forward, she scored two goals, two to three goals. Uh, and she was named CHA Player of the Week for that performance. Can you talk a little bit about her effort? Uh, Mackenzie's done a great job this year, especially the last couple of weeks, really, you know, taking it to the goal every time with the puck. And, you know, I was really excited to see her score just because the freshmen, anytime they score, we all get excited because it kind of picks up the upperclassmen. So uh, when she got that first goal, it was a beauty. You know, it really brought the team together, and I think that's what we bounced off of for the rest of the game. And the second goal was just great. I mean, there's nothing like having a two-goal two lead. Mm -hmm. Uh, and this weekend, with that win, uh, it broke the Eagle season school record for victories with 20. Uh, and this is also the eighth straight week that Army's found itself in the top 10. Do you think all the success uh, will prepare the rest of the team for, or prepare the team for the rest of the season? Uh, you know, it's a it's a fine line that the team walks when you're being successful. Um, you know, the girls, you, you want them to realize how good they are doing, but you also don't want them to um, have ego issues and take it for granted. So I think going into the next couple weekends, they really need to face the season like, you know, it's one game at a time and don't worry about what happened in the past and focus on, you know, Friday's game first, you know, figure out what happens then and then worry about Saturday the next day. Okay, and on Friday you have Lindenwood. Uh, this is the last away weekend of the month. Uh, what are you looking to see? Uh, we're really looking for the adjustments that we did with the Lions to really work and click and have a lot of energy for our team. Um, every Friday, it's always hard. You know, you come off the bus, you have a road trip. Depending on the different scenarios that the week brings, we really want the girls to come out fast and flying and really working together. Okay, thank you and good luck this weekend.